Hey, it's Josh over at J&H. Today we're taking a look at the Vanstall VR150 spinning reel. Uh, this is another winner from Vanstall. Basically what they've come out with is a less expensive version uh, of the uh, of their Vanstall series, the VS, uh, which is the VR. And I shouldn't really say that it's a version of it. It's really is a totally separate platform created by the same guy who created the original Vanstall. Uh, but it is a totally new series, new platform. Uh, it's very similar to the Z-Bass in terms of its design. You know, all the bodies on all, all the VRs are the same. Um, and what that allows them to do is it allows them to make uh, different sizes at a lower cost, so it brings the price down. So instead of a reel that's in the 700s somewhere, this reel retails for $529. It's got a, a great drag system, you know, 42 pounds of drag at max, so more than enough drag for especially surf fishing. But, you know, if you're boat fishing with this, um, you know, it's perfect for that. It comes with the bale and bailless in the same box. So again, if you're surf fishing, you take the bale off. If you're fishing on a boat, you put the bale on. And uh, so you get the best of both worlds. It weighs in at 15.8 ounces, so it's nice and lightweight. You're looking at stainless steel gears. You know, the main and the pinion gear are hardened stainless steel. Uh, the shaft is stainless steel coated in titanium. The body is aluminum, uh, which keeps the weight down. Nice aluminum handle with this uh, Delrin knob. Um, it's basically just like a hardened material feels almost like a plastic maybe it is a version of a plastic but what it is it's, it's basically weightless so it doesn't add weight to the reel you know I've seen reels in the past where the handle alone weighs you know two three ounces and it just changes the reel but this one keeps it nice and lightweight it has a, uh, a manual trip to it so you do got to flip it over yourself uh, which is good because you know when you're casting you don't have to worry about you know the bale flipping over and cutting your line losing an expensive lure or something like that uh, gear ratio on this is uh, 4.75 to 1 so again, surf fishing guys, you know, when you're, you're fishing those plugs, you got to do it, you know, nice and slow. This is perfect for that. Eight ball bearings. It's nice and smooth, but it's not made to be like a, you know, like Shimano smooth. This thing is made to be waterproof, which is what it is. Fully waterproof, fully sealed, submersible, waterproof drag system, waterproof everything. And that's why you're buying this reel. You're getting this reel because you want a waterproof reel. And there are very few um, that, can, that can claim that, but this one definitely can. Pair this up with the nine, nine and a half foot surf rod if you're fishing from the beach. You know, on the boat, you're gonna go with a, you know, a seven foot rod of some kind, uh, six and a half, something like that. But you just want, you know, a rod that can handle, you know, a bigger frame reel, which is which is what this is. Uh, it, it's gonna hold 440 yards of 30 pound test braid, but you're gonna put on here, you know, probably 300 to 40 if you're fishing from the beach. I guess some guys like 30, some guys like 50, but regardless of what you're doing, it's just it's just a great all around reel. It's the waterproof reel. Where you don't have to spend seven or eight hundred bucks, uh, you're still spending a you know a fair amount of money, but it's definitely worth it. This thing will last you a very long time as long as you keep it clean and take care of it. So check it out. It's the Vanstall VR150 spinning reel. They are in stock and available at JaneH.com.